welcome to me messing around in this game. Dying light. Oh. Okay, that was an accident. Oh yeah, just gonna. No, come on. Yes, that that's exactly what I've been doing. Really, is I've been kicking zombies off here because it's fun. But the real reason for me doing this. Oh, I'm at a safe house technically. Oh, okay. Um, yep. No, get back. Yes, weird. Dude, just. Oh man. Nice. Dick. No, no, bad. Oh, all right. Dead. Never mind, I'm gonna search you as you fall off. Okay. Anyway, my main reason for doing this is that I I need to rant. Like hella bad. Uh, cause I am just so fed up, pissed off. It's unbelievable. But I am. And it's just really maddening at the reason why is because you all know I was talking about the group with Haley and them. Ah, well, that's not a thing anymore. Why? Because Haley and Austin uh, fucked it up. Like really, oh my, God, really bad, dude. Can you not? Oh, fuck. Uh, they they were really making me mad. Like hella bad. Uh, they they made all of us mad, or both of them made the rest of us mad. Me, Danielle, and Allison. Yeah, we're fed up. We're done. We're done with them. Uh, he had the balls to um, what was it? Oh, that's right. Uh, he had the balls to block us on Facebook when he's the one who started it. To begin with, that is, anyway. So, yeah, probably not his smartest move. Uh, he just really, uh, I'm gonna say zero in this episode. I, ooh, yay. No! No! I don't know about that. It's taking me hella far from where I want to go. Oh, shit, this took me to the school. Uh... Nope. I'm not freezing for anybody. Hey! Hey! Nope! Nope! This is not my uh, type of Silent Hill thing. Hey! Wow, this is sucking hardcore. There's so. Oh my god. So, while running, you just. Boom! Oh. Okay. Then. Really pissing us off. Um. Dude, uh, he, he screwed himself. He put the final nail in his coffin just a couple days ago when he blocked us on Facebook. Unwarranted, by the way. I mean, maybe Allison, because Allison was uh, being a bit of a bitch. But she has every right to be a bitch. To him, at least. Because uh, he left without even saying goodbye at the cabin, like I said. And it was her birthday. Or about to be her birthday. When it was at midnight. They left around 11.50 something. And 
and it just really pissed her off to no end. So, uh, uh, we don't feel sorry at all for anything that happened. Uh, we literally... Brecken, the garrison's shut down. The doors are sealed off. I don't think I can get in. Find another way in, then. Check the back, but don't take any stupid chances. Those bastards will rip you apart if they get the opportunity. Yeah, I know they will, which is why I don't want to be here. Yeah, Austin really fucked himself over. Like, hella bad. Like, we were willing to be friends with them. But they screwed up way too bad for any of us, I mean any of us, to deal with him. And it just, it enrages me. It enrages me why they did what they did, because none of us understand why they did any of it. It baffles us all. Okay, I found an entrance. I can't say it was easy though. I'm going in. Just keep your eyes open. Good luck in there. Ah, these bastards have guns. We're all going to get one. Yeah. Oh, shit. I was dead. Okay. So that does work. To be noted. But yeah, Austin enraged us all and none of us could deal. We all just... Oh, none of us could... No. None of us could fathom at what made them do what they did. None of us understand it. Because we literally did nothing to them. They're literally, their only complaint was that they felt awkward because Danny and I were dating. That's literally all they had. Or all he had, at least. Haley was pissed off or something else, I think. Oh, that didn't work. Again. I mean, you don't got company, I don't know what you're talking about, dude. You're drunk. Hey. Nope, you're drunk. Dude. Hey, you. Um. Look. Look at what? You're crazy. You're drunk, dude. Just shh. Relax. Eat a cocoa bean. What's going on? You're drunk, I told you, dude. You're high on something. You're high on the. Oh, fuck. My. I did not mean to do that. It's so sad. What if I do this? Wow. I'm just dying. I don't. Finally did it. I decided to, you know, just cut. So you guys don't have to see all of that torture. What the fuck was that, dude? I gotta do the grunting now. Uh, oh, oh, come on. Why is this jump necessary? Like this jump. Oh, I get it. It's the what? I don't know if I can make that. They're way down there. Anyway, as I was ranting about Austin and Haley being little dick bags. Uh. Well. Yeah, like I said, none of us will deal with them. Shit. 
just because, yeah, why would why would any of us deal with them? One, for people who are supposed to be my best friend, for like two years, it's a bit shitty for them to uh, kind of turn on me like that, just like stab me in the back. I'm just gonna I need to take a breather. Is he dead now? You're Austin. And now that I've named you Austin, you're probably gonna kill me. So I need a breather. Nope! Please tell me you're dead. Nope. Oh. Okay. Good extreme. I just exploded Austin's head off. Uh. So. What's this? Crude pick. Might as well. Anyway. Yeah. So he pissed us off big time. He tried. No. He tried talking to us and a Facebook chat, even though we deleted it, because of him and his dumbass self, along with two others, well, one of them. I'd be on the side with two others. Hey, you, uh, you're gonna die, you're Haley. Yeah, you're Haley. Oh, oh, that was the perfect opportunity to kick you off. Uh, yeah, if you're gonna do that, I'm just gonna smack you in the face because you're a Haley. Nope. Not today. Ow. Fucker. I don't care what you have to say, dude. Dick. Dick. Dick, that's what dicks get. Dicks get their head freaking smacked off, I guess. I don't know, what do you have? Beef cleaver? Okay. Okay, that was nice. You're down. That's excessive force, everybody. Just letting you know that. There's one more person. Okay, yeah, they're dead. Uh, big time. Not just dead. Pick up that club hammer while I'm at it. And I don't... Use to speak to Austin or Haley now. Uh, which I guess is nice. No, actually not. It's a bit shame, honestly. It sucks. But you know what? I can do without them. If they're gonna act like shitty friends and be petty because they can't handle me and Danny being happy together, then they can screw off. Like, I'm sorry, but if it's too awkward for us to be together for you, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna change just for you. Uh, I don't think either of us are gonna break up with one another just so our friendship can stay intact. Especially after what you pulled. Like, I'm sorry, but what Austin did was just not good. Because he went, he, he, te he started texting Allison about how he thought it was awkward, all five of us together, with all of us there, everybody, all of us, including Danny. No, I'm kidding. Not including her. No, no. Apparently, Why the group kidnapped Zara, raided his truck, and took all his gear. I just hope they didn't take all his research as well. Pretty sure I don't want to be in here. Crane here. I could really use some GRE support right now. That's too bad, Agent Crane. This is the Ministry of Defense. Fuck! What the hell's going on? What happened to the GRE? 
The global relief efforts position here has been diminished. We are in charge now, and we have declared Haran a code one target zone. Wait, 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 wait. Just hang on. You, you can't just carpet bomb this place. There are still hundreds of innocent people in here. Maybe thousands. Irrelevant. We're doing this to protect billions of lives. Surely you can understand that. Okay, okay just, just listen. There's this scientist in here named Zara, and he's been doing research on a cure, and he's really close. I've seen the research. If you bomb the city, just... Acknowledged. The chances of one scientist in a wrecked city coming up with useful results are negligible at best, but you have 48 hours. Oh, that's bullshit. I can craft a new item, guys. But yeah, just he went to Allison and started talking to her about he was like but it's pretty awkward when all five of us are together with him right now that they're dating and allison was like nope not really uh it's just you you're the only one dude oh which honestly austin should just kept his mouth shut and should have just like no especially when no, why would you go to the girl's best friend and talk about it if you don't want to start shit? Because we all assumed he wanted to start shit because he went to Allison knowing Allison would relay what he... What she was being... Well, what she was being sent. So he had to know when Allison would tell Danny. And then Danny would tell me. Because I don't have Allison's number. Which honestly is probably not that bad of a thing. I don't really care. She doesn't serve me a friend. Kinda hurts. I'm kidding. It doesn't hurt at all. It's just, nah, I don't care. Mm, shit, it's broken. Oh, Maybe I can why? Pry it open. No, hey, hey yo. Yeah, let's pry this open. Oh. Okay. Nope, nope. Oh ho ho. And we're Save in. it. Um, maybe. Dude, Crow, you didn't really think this out. Kidding. Oh. oh my god, dude. Just open the damn door. Oh shit, there's somebody on this level. I'm just gonna. Hope the hell I killed him. Uh, cause that was a manslaughter. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that felt good actually. Only because I usually get my ass kicked by these guys. But there was just one and then I just kinda... I kinda killed him. Oh man, these throwing knives are everywhere. Like, Jesus Christ. But yeah. He relayed the message stupidly. To Allison, which was uh, probably the dumbest move anybody could ever do. Yeah, there's nobody else in here with you. Yeah, I feel like they're dead. Crap. They're coming in here. Hey! Hey! Fucking ninja right there! Hey, no! Oh. Or you just make it. No! Yeah, you're gonna die! Oh shit. Alright, so now that I got that out of my system, uh. So, these mother. <laughs> say, kidding. Austin is just, uh. Not in the greatest spot right now. Not at all. He just, he's really screwed himself. Understand why he had to go and cause this drama. Or. 
I say him because it's him who did all the talking recently and it's him who restarted this whole shit. Uh, but it's not just him, it's also Haley. Him and Haley both started this. They both created this and it's just, it's dumb. It's stupid. Where are you, old friend? It's bullshit. I don't want to hear one of my friends who I've been friends with for over a decade talking shit about me and my girlfriend behind my behind our back. Like that's not cool. Just saying, not cool at all. It's bullshit. Why? Why would you do it? What? What do you earn from this? What do you get? What do you gain? You don't gain anything, you lose. Like he did, he lost three friends. Because him and Haley decided fuck they wanted to do. And it just didn't go completely their way. And guys, remember the love we did to the other ones? Yeah, we're gonna do it to him too. I have to fix it. Nope. Hey, motherfucker. Dude! Where's my- <laughs> Bullshit. About, fuck it. About time one of you assholes gave me a med kit. But yeah. Him and Haley caused all of this drama. Haley started it by snapping on- Well, not snapping on Austin, but losing to Austin in Mortal Kombat and then snapping on me and Danielle. Which neither one of us liked, considering we sat there in front of my house for like, I don't know. Oh, fuck. Ah. Oh. That was quite the build up. For a whole lot of nothing, in my case. But yeah, it just, no, why would you do it? I don't. See what Reckon, I couldn't you find Zana inside. The building looks empty though. There's an underground level. Maybe he's down there. Oh no. Why do you know this shit, Breckham? I don't wanna go down there. Oh no, it's hard. Okay, that wasn't that was easy. <laughs> Well, it's easier than I thought it was gonna be anyway. Holy shit. We turn you into scrap. I'm gonna pick up that. Holy shit. That was a good chest. That was a good find. Wow. Uh, my dude had a little issue trying to pick up those cosmetics. I don't think he really wanted to, but he's going to have, but he did it anyway. He didn't really have a choice, honestly. I was gonna make him do it whether he wanted to or not. Yes. Pistol ammo four. Oh. I'm gonna take all the police rifle you got. Why? For reasons. Uh anyway. Yeah, so Austin's not a thing in our life anymore. Austin's gone. And that's all we need to know. Honestly. That's all really. Like, no. Austin's a no-go. Oh, fuck me. This is not gonna bode well for anything. <laughs> Prepare to see me fail, right? Okay, so three shots does it. That's nice to know. I guess you shoot somebody at point blank and it's... Oh, uh, honestly? There he is! Fire. 
Oh, he was hit. Wow. He, uh, stepped into the fire. Hey. That's not what I wanted. Um, a bit scared. Hey. 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 Fuck you. Dude. You know how many times I shot you? Loading a clip in again. This is how much I don't like you guys. Hi. Bullshit. I thought there was two of them. Oh, shit. I'm just gonna take that. Why? Because I can't even have one too. Let's open this. And no. apparently, yep. Who is it? Who's bad? Blackstock, it's me. Green. Thank God. Listen, this is important. I'm not safe anymore, obviously. But my research must not die with me. You're not gonna die, Doc, but right now we have to get out of here. So please, lower your voice. Oh, oh, yes, all right. But understand, my research, it must reach Dr. Camden. That's why I gave the packages to Jade. I know you said you would deliver them. But she was there, and time being of the essence. Doc? Oh shit. Oh. So, it takes no more than a false hope of rescue to lose the good doctor's lips. I'm the Scorpion Down, spare no resource. With pleasure. And these two? What should we do with them? You'll never find her. Never. And I'll never talk. You'll get nothing from me. I'm less concerned with making you talk, Doctor, than I am in preventing your escape. <laughs> Sadistic fuck, he's an old man! Give the Doctor some first aid. And take her into the pit. That's nice. Oh. oh shit. Doc. You come to us like a snake in the grass. Here, in a city of lies, you are the biggest liar of them all. Who are you talking about? Answer me, motherfucker! Yes. Lose control. That is what you Americans are so good at after all. Corpses. Leave Crane. Yes, sir. Oh. 
Pump. What? But yeah, Austin just really screwed everything up. Just everything. I cannot lie. Everything up is good. And for what? I don't know. None of us understand it. None of us know why he did it. Dude, stop missing. There we go. That's a good hit. But yeah, Austin just know. Austin and Haley both. Like, I've been friends with them for almost 14 years. Technically, it's still 13, and it won't be 14 until August. Or it would have been 14 in August. You know, if I was still friends with them. But I'm not. And she was friends with Danielle for four years, and Danielle was like her only friend ever, the girl. Like, I'm not even fucking kidding you. And so, yeah, Haley just lost her only friend that was a girl. All because I don't think she really liked us being together. I mean, I could really give a rat's ass if she likes us being together if she didn't. Because it's not her decision. She shouldn't really care. She has no room to give a fuck. The only thing she really needs to do is just be supportive of our decisions. As a friend, because that's what friends do, we're supportive of each other. I hate it though. Apparently. No. Hey, just gonna snap on us because. Ow. Shit, that's close. Oh, I'm just gonna try this. But yeah, Austin and Haley just fucked up big time. Like, we were friends for almost 14 years. I cannot stress that enough. Almost 14 years. And then Danielle and Haley were friends for four years. They've been friends since like freshman year. But Haley just. I guess she couldn't stand me being with Danielle. And I don't understand why not. I mean, it's not like we ever had anything, me and Haley. We, neither one of us, no. Yeah. Awesome. Hey, bitch. Hey! No. Fucker. Okay, so that's another one bites the dust, but... Word of your feet here will spread. Such a shame you'll be a corpse by then. What do you mean? Is this your first feeble attempt at controlling your own destiny, Crane? Too little, too late, I fear. Uh. Impressive for a walking dead man. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about, but I'm just going to. I'm just gonna stay up here if you're gonna keep talking like that. Uh, I'll pick up the machete. Oh, I see it. I don't like this. Mainly because I'm not. Oh, fuck.
how about not? Maybe I'll die right after I kill him. Like a little bitch. Especially. Oh. Yeah, you die. Hey! Oh, you are infected and will experience seizures of drinking and mental. I've provided some quality entertainment for my men. To bread it's a one time performance. What? Uh, do you mean? This will only prolong the inevitable, but try to make the best of it, huh? What are you talking about? Why can't I search? There's no one say I never gave you anything, Crane. Take the red kit. I'm going to assume it's not right there. It's going to be the yellow dot. a surprise crane. The GRE selects its operatives well. <sighs> Shit. Lower the platform. Hassan, can you hear me? Loud and clear. Publish the fire. Right away, sir. And there. Easy is dead. You just doomed thousands of innocent people! That's what you get with your fucking chaos! You don't know what was on that fire, do you, Brian? You need to prove my point for me. The GRE plans to weaponize the virus, not cure it. They're only interested in profit. Not saving lives. And by following their rules, you have become their trained monkey. Pathetic. All right. Kill him. Oh, shit. Why can't I do that in the real game? Badass can this guy get? Doc, come on, let's get you out of here. Green, save these people. They don't deserve all of this. You, give me that torch. <laughs> That's a bit drastic. What are you trying waiting for? Shoot him! I'm sorry, Doc. God damn. 
dude. Oh, okay. I can't fall. Whoa! I'm dead. Construction site. Oh my god, that reminds me of the one arena. Of his now I gotta haul ass back to Brecken. But Zara, he didn't make it. He said he gave his research to Jade before Rice grabbed him, so there might still be a shred of hope for a cure. Why does everybody die? Everybody dies. Freaking everybody. I'm kidding. I don't. Honestly, no, I only know a lot of people have died already. Like, they're all like, we can't afford to lose any more people, and then, like, no, no, people die. No, no. No, no. Sarah. Sarah's dead. Yeah, and you're gonna be dead too if you don't fucking move it. Dumbass. <laughs> Oh, where am I? That's a hide you at the pier. Half of Rice's men are after you. Whatever you've done, it's really put them on the warpath. I have to talk to Jade. Zara, he gave her his research. She took it to Camden, and she tried to. Camden radioed that Rice's thugs had found his lab. So he flooded it with biters and barricaded himself in the middle. Now he's trapped. Then the connection failed. We haven't been able to raise him since. I'm going after her. How is she getting in? That part of town is sealed off. There's a group called the Saviors that smuggles people through. They have a den at Nico's bar in the cauldron near the highway. The contact's name is Cheng. Do, do you have enough runners to cover airdrops? The airdrop stopped 36 hours ago. There won't be any more. We're out of time, Crane. Shit. Alright. I don't know if I can fix this, but I'm sure it's all gonna try. Yeah. Most men in your situation will crawl into a hole and hide. Hats off to you, mate. And good luck. Hey, Crane. Here's your gear. Best regards from Kareem. <laughs> Kareem, huh? Well, if you see him, thank him for me. Wait, what? Seriously? everything in there holy shit dude you are my hero oh my god yes uh if you wonder why i got so many police rifles uh it's not for keepsakes uh do you see how much that shit sells for yeah anyway uh so basically, trade dude. Seriously, so like, sleeping fat guy. Never mind. But yeah. So essentially, Austin is like being a really big dick, and so was Haley. They both are. And me, Allison, and Danny. 
or Allison, Danny, and I, we're all done with it. We're done. Like, we're no longer gonna deal with those two. For all the shit they have done to us. So... I mean, I don't really blame any of us. Because that was bullshit. They, they handled it like a child. Because honestly, they just kept complaining and complaining and kept saying, Oh, but they're, it's a very awkward now that those two are a couple. I'm just like, oh, okay, yeah, because it wasn't awkward when you two dated twice, right? But now that I'm dating one of you, Ailey's friends that became our friends, <laughs> I'm sorry, when two people who are, when two people are attracted to each other, they tend to, I don't know, date. I know, right? Crazy. <laughs> Crazy stuff. I mean, I can't believe the thought. Yeah, so let's defriend them for, you know, dating and trying to see if they like each other. Or they want to be with each other. Yeah. Let's turn our backs on them because they want to be together. And they're happy together. Because we are. Allison said it herself. I don't know if that was just to spite Austin or what, but she said it. Danny even seems happier that we're together. But this whole situation has just pissed her off beyond belief. Like, it's not even funny. But, I mean, it is what it is. Uh, they're no longer a part of my life, so hooray to that. <sighs> they just... I don't... I don't... I can't. Words escape mind. They're mind, mind-boggling dumbasses that I just can't handle right now, so... <sighs> and I won't have to deal with them. Probably for a very very long time. Hopefully. Um, so with that, top toss for now. Man, this video is going to be a bitch to edit. But hey, it was worth the rant. It was really worth the rant. I really needed it, even though I got distracted a lot, but I still got the gist, pretty much. <laughs> Again, ta-ta for now.